Happy Thursday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Thursday, November 17th. You pick a card. It's your main energy, but I do pull the cards together. They are for everyone. And um, if you're born today, November 17th, I'll do a reading for you next. Card number one is the Ten of Wands. Well, a burden that you've been carrying or something that you've been, I want to say, weighing on your chest is, I want to say, was worth it, but. You need to surrender and release it today. You're carrying up too many disappointments and too many frustrations. Do not bite off more than you can chew today. Simplify things. You do not have to accept blame for some of you out there is what I feel. Um, there is someone who is, I want to say, they may make you feel guilty or it's like um, they're kind of interfering. This could be a trigger, pain from the past. It's just let it go. A new path is opening up for you. You're, you're coming to the end of a burden. Card number two is the Magician. This is a major arcana, so it's an important day for you. It's a major arcana. This indicates to me all that you want and desire is there before you. You're picking up the pieces somehow. This could be someone from the past um, that has hurt you, who you felt has betrayed you may surprise you in the future. If not today, the energy is here. They may want to redeem themselves. Um, this could, doesn't have to be a love interest. The uh, This could be kind of like, mm, what's going on? I'm picking up that energy. Okay? There's an ending here. All is going to be okay. Stressful period's over. Um, romance is coming into your life. And I do feel here, slow down. Haste makes waste. Don't make quick decisions. Because you are the creator today too. What you create from a situation is what is going to lead to the future. Interesting. As above, so below. Manifestations could have came to fruition here. Page of Pentacles for card number three. Wow. If you are thinking of doing public speaking, if you are thinking of doing something on social media or with a group of people, that is going to be lucrative in the future. You are manifesting. Manifestation is high. Um, if you've been trying to manifest something or popularity or something good with work or whatever it is, there's luck on your side. Success is there. Manifestation is high. You have many opportunities, new ones opening up for you. You have support around you. Maybe there's different people that you usually don't talk to, a new social group. I don't know. I see that. But manifestation is very high today. Something's going to be great and lucrative in the future. Ten of Wands, the Magician, the Page of Pentacles. What doesn't come through... A disappointment is going to be a blessing in disguise because I see blessings coming in. There is a no answer to some, a question someone has. There is a change with career for some of you, a change coming in with finances. Um, this is a taking a leap of faith. Something is ending. Maybe it's um, financial obligation, um, being more self-reliant. I do see even with home, there could be opportunities. Maybe real estate is in, in question here. Blessings are coming somehow and fortune. And I do feel this is a change of direction with work or career too. Friendships, new friendships coming in. Friends are supportive. Don't hold on to energy too tightly though. This is a very um, strong time where 
a lot of things that we manifest now could come through by, let's say, July next year. I don't know why. I just said that. Friendships are around new ones, um, supportive ones too. Pay attention to the signs. There's a lot of spirituality here today. Let your intuition guide you. The signs are there. Libra energy. I pick up a Libra too. All right, so that is the reading for today, Thursday, November 17th. Have a fabulous Thursday. Happy birthday if you're born today, November 17th. This is a quick and general reading. This is your soul or your theme. That's your wish card. I do offer readings like this and others, um, birthday readings on my website. The Two of Cups. Two of Cups. This is a soulmate connection, understanding uh, partnerships in private life, on business, Talks are important, beautiful, dating if you're single. If you're not, it's mingling. It's um, a new friendship coming in. It's beautiful. There is a need of self-acceptance this year. And then you're going to draw in what you want. There is more harmonious energy in relationships, friendships. Someone around you that you know already is going through a spiritual growth and you're spiritually growing together. Um, I do feel new friendships are coming in, new social circle. It is important to professionally and socially network this year. You will find luck and success. There are things you need to give up to get something else. Meditation. Sitting still is going to bring you epiphany and answers. You get a lot of spiritual growth and harmony coming into your life and self-acceptance. You will get something significant that you want this year. Um, things are going to be falling into place. You will be organizing, getting things under control. You have luck. There is abundance everywhere. The only thing is you're going to have to be patient at time and tolerant. Your wish card, the Queen of Pentacles. This wish, um, a female earth sign may be significant, come into play somehow. But this indicates to me a balance, delays are going to benefit you. Why? Because maybe there's adjustments with this wish or be careful what you wish for, so to speak. But this is going to come through. It's going to benefit you. For some of you within 20 days or the date 20 is big for some reason. Okay. All right. Important numbers for your solar year. 6, 12, 2, 20, 15, 22, 5. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solo year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Thursday and bye for now.